King Charles and Queen Camilla hit by more protests at historic Royal Maundy service. King Charles and Queen Camilla have faced yet more protesters at an historic Royal Easter service today. The couple were at York Minster for the annual Royal Maundy service, where Charles fulfilled the ancient duty of distributing Maundy money to community stalwarts. It was the first time he had carried out the duty as king, although he stepped in for the late queen last year, who was unable to carry out the service. Today, the king and queen, wearing a navy and white dress by Fiona Clare and a Philip Tracy hat, were greeted at the Great West Doors by the Dean of York, the very Reverend Dominic Barrington, and the Archbishop of York, Stephen Cottrell. They were presented with the traditional nosegay a small flower bouquet intended to ward off unpleasant smells, as they entered the cathedral. The royal couple were greeted by hundreds of cheering woe-wishers but also a handful of noisy demonstrators as they left their car in the sunshine. The group from the anti-monarchy organization Republic held up signs saying, Not my king, after they promised to target events leading up to the coronation. They've already targeted engagements in Milton Keynes and Colchester as well as the Commonwealth Day service at Westminster Abbey last month. However, once inside, the royal couple carried out the traditional gesture with Charles presenting 74 men and 74 women, reflecting his age, with the Maundy money in front of a congregation of 1,500. The money is presented to thank the recipients for their outstanding Christian service and for making a difference to the lives of people in their local communities. The king presented each recipient with a red and a white purse, stopping to chat with many. The white purse contained a set of specially minted silver Monde coins equivalent in value to the age of the king. The red purse contained two commemorative coins. This year, one celebrates the king's forthcoming 75th birthday and the other commemorates the 75th anniversary of the Windrush generation. After the royal couple emerged, they spent 20 minutes in the sunshine talking to the crowd in a lengthy walkabout. The royal Mondi is an ancient ceremony which originated in the commandment Christ gave after washing the feet of his disciples the day before Good Friday.